Hello everyone, our lesson for today is all about visualizing multiplication of fractions using models. This is our problem. Sasha has a piece of plastic cover 3 fourths meter long. He used one part of it to cover his book. What fractional part of the plastic cover did he use? To answer this problem, we're going to use visual representation. For example, this is a piece of plastic cover. We're going to show three fourths. Three is the numerator, and the numerator tells the shaded parts, and four is the denominator, and it tells how many parts the whole will be divided. So our denominator is four. We're going to divide this whole into four equal parts. Our numerator is 3, so we're going to shade 3 parts out of 4 parts. Okay, this is 3 fourths. Next is, he used 1 fourth of it to cover his book, so we're going to show 1 fourth. But this time, we're going to divide the whole 4 equal parts horizontally. Then we're going to cover or we're going to shade one part. We have yellow and blue. If we're going to combine yellow and blue, the resulting color is green. So how many green colors or how many green parts do we have? We have three parts. How many parts all in all? We have 16 parts all in all. So this is the answer to our problem. What fractional part of the plastic cover did he use? He used 3 sixteenths of the plastic cover. We have another example using visual representation. We have three figures. For the first figure, it shows one shaded point and there are three equal parts so this is one side then we're going to multiply this one to the second figure the second figure one shaded point and there are two equal points so this is one half then we're going to find the product but before that we're going to show first one third in our blank figure so this blank figure we're going to divide this one into three equal parts and we're going to shade one part okay this one third and we're going to show also one half but this time we're going to divide vertically two equal parts then we're going to shade also one part okay if we're going to combine blue and yellow the resulting color is green so how many green parts do we have we only have one part and how many parts all in all in our figure there are six parts so the fractional part is one six this is the answer if we're going to multiply one third times one half 